Hello Beauty and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, well welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing what happens when the students leave. You're probably like, what are you talking about? I am a daughter of a teacher, therefore I have the insight of what happens when students are no longer at school. After the last day of school, teachers are required to be in their classroom one or two days, depending on the school, after the students leave. And this What's in this video are just a few of the things that happen when students are no longer in the classroom. What, the, what teachers have to do to prepare for summer and next year. So I hope you all enjoy this video and let's get started. So one of the things teachers have to do is put old lesson plans into a binder so they have them for next year if they want to use them. And so here I am putting my mom's old lesson plans into a binder in laminated paper and labeling them so she can find them and then I'm putting dividers in between them so then you can see the different subjects. The second thing that teachers have to do is clean off their desks, their surfaces of everything and put them inside the desks so movers can come and take the desks out and clean the classroom. And so here I am putting away my mom's miscellaneous things that she didn't have a chance to do already before I came. I put them in there for her. I put them in there for her. Interpret it somehow that delicious little hiccup in space times continue. Maybe it didn't mean anything, maybe it was just one of those things, whatever. teachers have to clean their computer because over the year it gets pretty dirty and if they don't stay on top of it then they have to clean it at the end of the year and so here I am cleaning the computer for my mom while she's putting paper against the bookshelf so the books don't fall out of the bookshelf. Here 
here's me cleaning off the desk of footprints that were on the desks and cleaning off some of the surfaces and me eating a cookie because my mom had nothing for me to do and then as I'm eating a cookie I'm dancing because there was music playing the whole time so why not dance? I see faces in the gray, in the music I see shapes, but the clouds I do neglect, for I walk with a bad head, but I watch where I am stepping, I intend what I am getting, that's you. With one color I could paint a whole world of black and gray, but with a piece of you I can introduce a hue that brings colors once unknown a warm resounding tone that is you Tell me once again that you'll always be my friend And I will know for sure not to ever close the door No matter what might happen in this loose chaotic pattern of us two There's a few words I am not very good at getting out But when I do I'm overwhelmed I think a magic spell, it's cliche, I know But I love you, there you go And it's true I am not very good at getting out But when I do, I'm overwhelmed I think they are a magic spell It's cliche, I know But I love you, there you go With one color I could paint A whole world of black out video if you did please like the like button down below and if you want to see more of my content you can click on one of the two boxes over here or my face over here if you if you want to see more of my life you can check out my social media there would be links down below i hope you all have a wonderful day and remember to be yourself because you're the only self you're ever going to be bye